We are now joined by five time Mizoram Chief Minister Lal Thanahawla. He is fighting a very crucial election. This is an election where the Congress is trying to save its last bastion in the Northeast. Mr. Lal Thanahawla, you are a veteran politician. You are perhaps the oldest Congress Chief Minister in the country. This is a tough elections, election for you. How dif difficult this election is, given the fact that you have been in power for 10 years, there should be some anti-incumbency. The BJP is trying to make an inroad, and you have your traditional opponent, the MNF, as well as the regional party alliance of ZPM. You see, I, my, feel, my actual feeling is this, the more the merrier. Because, you know, even in spite of being in power for 10 years, nobody feels anti-incumbency. Uh, neither win, not to speak of wave, not even win is there, except by the opposition. Otherwise, if there has been any anti incumbency win, nobody would have joined my party till today, till yesterday. Uh, BJP's uh, uh, convener for NEDA, Himanta Bishwa Sharma, in an exclusive interview to our channel, said that, you know, we are open to, we are neutral to both Mr. Zoram Thanga as well as Lanthana uh, We are against Congress as a party, but not against any individual. If you want to vote for me, they are most welcome. But then, uh, working together with BJP is the farthest thing from my mind. It is the farthest thing from my mind. I have no uh, similarity with them, neither in policy nor in ideology. So. Working together, even pre poll or post poll is the farthest thing from my mind. But you have worked together with the BJP in a local council in the Chakma area. It is a very, very small portion. There are only a handful. But the, the church has been uh, traditionally a bit skeptical about uh, the prohibition that you repealed. This time MNF says that if it comes to power, it will impose prohibition. Yeah. The church might s support them indirectly. Uh, also, the church ha is in a catch-22 position because the BJP is trying to make an inroad, which is seen as an anti-Christian party. So, mm -hmm. where do you see Congress in this situation? What would be your stand on prohibition? The Congress position is very good, very comfortable, and I'm form I'm going to form three consecutive ministries in this state, which has never happened before. 